Hello everyone, today I'm going to be having a look at this Aircraft Powerglide Cordless Hard Floor Cleaner. This model has the Good Housekeeping Approved 2020 recommendation. It's also got the Quiet Mark, so this should be very quiet in use. Okay, let's open the box and see what's inside. Now the Aircraft Powerglide comes with different pads for different surfaces and not all models will come with the pads I'm showing you. So if you want to buy one of these, check the pads that you get. Some come with all the pads, some only come with two sets of two. You can of course buy additional pads if you need them. So we have uh, an instruction book. We have two pairs of these pink pads with a very nice soft outer. This would be ideal, I think, on a bathroom floor because that will go up against your toilet and sink, etc., and give you a clean right to the edge without damaging any surfaces. And then this particular one also comes with two pairs of these general purpose microfiber pads. Now, where I bought it from, I also got these additional scrubbing pads which are designed for heavily soiled areas. They're just a different type of microfiber. Now, all the pads are very soft and shouldn't harm delicate flooring, but I expect if you've got very delicate floors not to use the scrubby type. It's mainly for hard wearing floors, ceramic tiles, etc. So here we have everything in the box. You get a little measuring cup. You can use detergent in the machine, but you can also use it with just plain water. This is the charging adapter because obviously we need to charge the battery before first use. Here we have the handle that also incorporates the on off switch and there's also a button here to release the solution. And here's the handle of the machine which is adjustable so you can adjust it to the most suitable height for you and of course when you're storing the cleaner away you can have it at its lowest height or you can store it away separately the base unit separate from the handle if you want to put it in a large drawer here we have the battery and it does give you an indication when it's charging of how full it is and finally the unit itself, this one's finished in black, you can get it in white from some retailers. So it's quite a nice wide cleaning path, it looks like it's got an LED light at the front. And here's where you put the pads, and it's a velcro type fitting, it does fit on very easily. They overlap slightly to give you a full width clean and because the pads are actually larger than the machine it means it will get right up to the edge of the room it'll go right to the baseboards underneath your kitchen units if you've got chairs it'll clean right up to the chair legs we've also got here this is where you put the small amount of water and as I said a small amount of detergent but you only need a tiny amount in this machine and just at the front here, very small hole, that's where the solution fires out when you press the button on the handle. So it's a simple machine, but hopefully if the demonstration that I've seen is uh, accurate, it should be quite useful. And because it's very, very quiet, if you want to clean your floor in the middle of the night and not disturb the neighbors, this could be your best bet. So here's the battery. Now I have pre-charged this prior to making the video but I'll just plug in the charger once more and just double check that all three lights on the battery are illuminated. The battery should take around two hours to fully charge and when it's fully charged all three lights on the battery symbol will be illuminated. Once you see this you can unplug it from the mains and it's ready to use. The battery fits into the base of the handle like so. The adjustable tube fits into the base of the power glide this way round with this slide switch towards the top and you'll see at the bottom here there's a little push switch so just insert it into the base of the unit until it clicks into position. 
The handle grip fits onto the tube in a similar way, but first we need to remove the batteries for the wireless remote control. There's a battery compartment here at the back of the handle. Two batteries are provided, but you need to first remove them because they're wrapped in cellophane. Just remove the cellophane from the battery and then reinsert them, making sure they go the correct way round. Once the batteries are correctly fitted, you can replace the cover. You can then insert the handle grip until it clicks into position. And finally, remove the protective film from the switches. To turn on the cleaner, you need to press this switch first. And then as you can see, the lights have illuminated. And then to operate the machine, we need to press the on off switch on the handle. I'm going to try the aircraft power glide on a ceramic tiled floor. So I'm going to remove these cleaning polishing pads and replace them with these cleaning pads with the soft edges. The clean water tank on the Power Glide takes a maximum of 300 millilitres and the measuring cup you get supplied goes up to 200 mil. So obviously if you want to fill the tank, top this up once and then go up to the 100 mil line. If you want to add some cleaning solution, add five milliliters of solution per full tank. Once you've filled the tank with warm water and your choice of hard floor cleaning solution, you're ready to use the aircraft power glide. After switching it on at the main switch at the base, all we have to do now is turn the cleaner on using this switch here. And to spray the solution, we use this button here.
Well, that's the kitchen floor cleaned. This floor is a cushioned vinyl. Let's have a look at the state of the pads. I think they might be quite dirty somehow. Well, not too dirty. I did wash the floor two days ago. But that's what the pads look like now. I'll compare those with the new set of pads. Now I've got a set of new pads here. We can definitely see the difference between the ones that have just cleaned this kitchen floor. Well folks, to end the video, I've changed venues and I've also changed floors. I've shown you how this machine cleans ceramic tiles and cushion vinyl. So now in this kitchen, I'm going to clean an Antico floor. This is like quite a posh laminate. It's sealed, it's suitable for kitchens and bathrooms, very hard wearing. So I thought I'd try the power glide on this type of floor. I've left this floor for about a week without washing it. So it is fairly dirty. And for this demo, I'm going to attach the scrubbing pads. I filled up the aircraft power glide with warm water and cleaning solution. I'm just using this supermarket own brand multi-surface cleaner. You can use virtually any floor or multi-surface cleaner in this machine. I wouldn't put bleach in it and I wouldn't put strong disinfectants, but any multi-surface cleaner should be fine. But don't forget, you only need a tiny amount because it is only a small container that holds the liquid. Okay, let's get cleaning. Don't forget to sweep or vacuum the floor before using your aircraft power glide. Okay, so I've cleaned the floor and it certainly feels much cleaner. I'm quite happy to be on this floor now, happy to walk across it with my socks without sticking to it. It's done a very good job. Let's have a look at the uh, pads, see how much dirt they've managed to trap. Wow, they are quite dirty. I only have uh, one set of these particular pads, so I can't compare it to a brand new unused set but I think you can see there quite a difference so all the dirt that was on the floor has been trapped in these machine washable microfiber pads well that's about the end of my demonstration on this aircraft power glide cordless hard floor cleaner 
This machine is a little bit different to many of the hard floor cleaners I've previously shown on my channel in the fact that it uses microfiber pads to trap the dirt instead of putting the solution down onto the floor, agitating it and then sucking it back up into a tank. So this works in a different way. It's certainly a lot quieter than the other hard floor cleaners I've used. It is very, very quiet. It's something you can use late at night without disturbing the neighbors. I like the fact it gets very close to the edge because the pads do overlap the machine, especially the bigger pads with the extra bit around the edge, ideal for your bathroom, getting around your pedestal, your sink, etc. And um, all in all, it's very good, very economical on water and cleaning solution, very light, easy to charge, easy to store away. If you have any comments or questions about this machine, please comment below. Don't forget to check out all my other videos, including a full playlist of carpet washers and hard floor cleaners. So until the next time, thanks for watching and I'll see you all very soon. Bye for now.